Hare Krishna. Opinions are like onions. Know when they need to be sealed and when peeled. Suppose somebody is dealing with onions. When they are to be transported from one place to another, at that time they need to be sealed so that they are preserved. But if they are to be used, then they need to be peeled. So, our opinions are something similar. There are times when we need to take a decision and move. Sometimes decisions have to be sealed. And this is the understanding I have. It may or may not be the perfect understanding. But life has to move on and this is the understanding I have to work with. But there are some times when opinions need to be peeled. Okay, this was my understanding. But does it really make sense? Uh, do I, why do I think like this? On what conception is this particular understanding, this particular opinion based? Is that right? Sometimes we need to go deep and examine our opinions. So, if we have an overall sense of the purpose of our life, then we will be able to uh, decide what needs to be done when. There are times when when we start with a particular decision, but then we realize, hey, this is not the right thing. Arjuna, for example, in the Bhagavad Gita, this first chapter towards the end, gives his opinion, say, saying that, I don't think I should fight this war. And he puts aside his bow, Visrujya Sacharam Chapam Shokasam Vignamanasaha. He puts aside his bow, but then he realizes, no, that's not the right thing because that still keeps me confused. So apparently he has sealed his opinion and expressed it through the action of putting aside his bow. But he realizes this is the time to peel the opinion. And that's why he had confesses in 2.6 that things don't make sense for me. That I don't know what I should do. He says that Nachaitad Vitmahakataran no Gariyo Yadma Jaye Mayadivano Jaye Yu Yane Vahatwana Jiji Vishamas Teyavastita Pramukedhar Tarashtra. So he says, whether to fight or not fight, I don't understand. And then he, he begins the peeling process by surrendering to Krishna and asking for understanding from Krishna. And thus, he progresses toward illumination. Thank you. Hare Krishna.